It's like 7.45, my hair looks crazy. We said we were gonna leave for the track at 7.30, so we're right on schedule. Uh, we are loaded up, bikes are ready. Actually, we should check and make sure the bikes are tight too. Oh, okay, cool. So yeah, we're gonna head to the track. So today, I guess, everybody meets at the track at 8.30, everybody drives from this place to the next location, uh, which is in, I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm tired and it's early, so. I was just flying the drone for like 15 seconds, uh, maybe like a minute, and then all of the cars started and then drove away. So <laughs> I had to like fly it back super fast. And yeah, so now we're driving. Uh, oh, my phone's in the drone controller. We grab that out of there. Okay. It's not that far, but it's somewhere. like a three hour drive. It's through like small roads, uh, small towns and stuff like that. So what do we got. You excited for our first power tour? Is this the start of Power Tour or was it yesterday? I mean, like, this is the part of the, the, the start of the part. tour. Yeah. The kickoff and the tour. This is actually the real tour. The real tour. So I didn't realize that, obviously, the Power Tour, it, normally it's a week, it's seven days, but this year it's five days. I didn't realize that there's like, some people don't go on the actual tour at all. Like, you'll just go to the car shows and take your own route, which I think is weird, but. The gas station stops in the small towns. So you get these little gas stations that are like, you know, mom and pop places, and then there's 50 cool cars stopping for gas. That's cool. Everybody get nice and stuff. So one of the things I'm looking forward to. Me too. <laughs> Decided when we see kids or people on the side, we're gonna give them stuff. You like stickers? Oh, yeah. Stickers. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> Did you back up? You bet. Yeah. yeah. We don't need gas, we've not driven very far, but just checking out cars in this gas station because there's so many of them. My favorite car so far.
have seen about 17 cops in the last 200 feet, so. So this is something weird. I don't understand the point of it um, versus just putting the top up, but. our first stop uh, this Google Maps thing kind of is brutal it doesn't seem to work like if you stop and start again so we got to figure that out for tomorrow but there's a lot of cars here <laughs> ah. So as we're going through, we're seeing a lot of the same cars because we're in the midway, but I'm noticing other details. Like I have this on yesterday's video, but oh, look at the wheel well. <laughs> I love this. Sweet. It's, it has to be on air, I would imagine. Yeah, look at the back. Yeah, no, I'm not, yeah, I mean. I never knew how to tell the difference between 68 and 69. I just asked my dad and he told me that, Josh told him, if it's bigger, it's a 69. If it's small like that, it's a 68. Either way, one of my favorite body styles ever. Like, I think people hate these because of this and this is why I like it, that swoop body line. It's just, I, I bet if you went through my videos, if you're a Buick person, you've heard me say that 500 times, but they just look super cool.
kid that owns this is 15. He said he and his dad built it two years ago. Uh, it's LS power. That's him. I gotta start building a car with Rob and Kate. We aren't the only Mercedes here. Uh, we are maybe we're the only AMG though. This is a one. So this guy's just here for dating. He's not doing the long haul. This thing is sweet though. E-class wagon. I really like my E-class. It was just such a big car. I kind of want an E63 because a 63 would be sweet. But This is a cool looking car, minus the Hot Wheels sticker that I don't really understand. Yeah, I like it a lot. Straight 12 Auburn. That's so cool. What a wild motor. This thing is great. I love it. I've always said the 65 Corvair looks like it would make the perfect tow vehicle. EFI, sniper EFI, just like what we've got. I'm to the point where I think we've looked at some of these cars, but I don't remember, so I'm just gonna keep showing them. Well, I bet it's been done for a while, it's sweet. It's like 90 something degrees, uh, but still pretty great out here. There's another old trailer, a little tiny one. Day two, stop two of the power tour in the books. Uh, well, not officially in the books. We're leaving the fairgrounds now. We're gonna head to the hotel and probably drive around and look at some more cars. Dayton, I think. I don't know that I've ever really been to Dayton. It's like an actual city though. When we were driving through, it looked like it. So I don't know if we'll be able to do like we did the last few nights and just drive through hotel parking lots and look at cars. I didn't video any of that because it's whatever. But hard to drive. 